guys, it's Lita Lam, and we're going to discuss the many virtues of MSM today. A great alternative for vegans to hydrolyzed collagen, a mega beauty supplement. It's good for so many things, for asthma, for allergies, for inflammation in your joints, arthritis. Let's discuss, shall we? Hey guys, it's Lita Lam, and today we're going to discuss MSM, a bioavailable natural sulfur. It's touted as a miracle supplement. It's a great beauty supplement, but it's also good for things like allergies, asthma, arthritis, all the A's. Let's discuss. Alrighty, you guys. So MSM, I have a video from forever ago. The quality is terrible. I probably should delete it, but MSM, you guys, and the reason I like bulk supplements is because there's no fillers. I sent my mother some supplements recently, and there's like, you know, fillers and flow agents in it, but bulk supplements never does that. That's why they're awesome. Yes, and this is not animal derived, so it's great. There's no other ingredients. MSM is good for so many things, and you can also make a simple spray for your face out of it. It dissolves easily in water. You can pack a whole lot of this powder if you want to make a potent toner you can pack a lot into just two ounces mostly you want it internally though it's got some great anti-inflammatory benefits used with vitamin c it's really great as for helping collagen synthesis you guys it's really great for cell permeability so that toxins and metabolic waste and inflammation can be excreted from your cells and then hydration and nutrients can be absorbed in and you can really feel this people with joint problems you've probably seen this in like at the whole foods or whatever sort of health food section for joints it's often coupled with chondroitin and you know turmeric and joint stuff it's great for your joints. So people with arthritis and tendonitis and whatever itis really feel benefit quickly. And really it absorbs into your bloodstream within 30, 35 minutes. And after a few weeks, you're gonna really feel a difference. I mean, reading the reviews is so fun. People are feeling a difference even after just a few weeks of taking it. So if you have any joint issues or injuries, it's great, it's great for that. It's really good for recovery from working out. Makes sense, you know, the permeability of your cells so it can release lactic acid and you know, absorb in the nutrients so you know, you're, you're not feeling achy you know, after doing rigorous exercises when you might normally feel that in your joints. It dissolves calcium phosphate, so calcium buildup, you know, calcium deposits in your joints and wherever, it can help release that because the calcium dissolves. Inflammation of your eyes, your mucous membranes, it makes sense, it helps with the inflammation. So that's maybe why it helps with allergy symptoms and the like. Reading the reviews of this stuff, people really see that besides their skin, you know, seeing the inner glow from their skin, they're, they're finding benefit pretty quickly from their joint pain and also allergies. So that's if you have that, you definitely should try it. So it really works well with vitamin C. So you should take it with vitamin C. Like I've been taking it with my little liposomal vitamin C. And I really feel an energetic difference when I do that because the amount of energy your body exudes to release the toxins and metabolic waste from your cells, it takes energy. So if you're facilitating that process, it makes sense it gives you more energy, eh? Ah, MSM really helps to facilitate the flexibility of the bonds between the cells. It's just, it, it just promotes flexibility. Studies where people have found that it really helps are with flexibility and inflammation in the joints, as well as allergies. And there was actually one with rosacea, using it topically for rosacea, along with milk thistle. It was apparently helpful for rosacea. I'm sure that would be helpful internally as well. Okay, MSM is found in a lot of foods, you know, in minute amounts, in fruits and vegetables and milk and some certain meats, in minute amounts. It's also part of the whole rain process. It rains down on your vegetables in, in rain. It helps increase the absorption of nutrients of your food. People all are also, a lot of testimonials about how it's helping their food absorption, helping with their gut symptoms. MSM helps your body produce glutathione, the master antioxidant. And I'm not sure about taking glutathione, 
straight up, you kind of want to, I think, support your body in producing its own glutathione. You don't want to kind of take that away. For, you, don't want, you want to encourage your body to make its own. The master antioxidant, glutathione, we want more of that. So MSM helps your body create that. So people are taking it for allergies, asthma, chronic fatigue syndrome, fibromyalgia, Alzheimer's disease, apparently it helps with that. Chronic pain, constipation, diabetes, hemorrhoids, high blood pressure, high cholesterol, migraines, osteoporosis, osteoarthritis, menstrual syndromes, interesting. Tendinitis, TMJ, and migraines, very interesting. So there's not really any contraindications. There's not really many symptoms that you could have besides maybe a little diarrhea. So if you're experiencing that symptom, you're taking too much and you might want to ramp up slower and uh, take less. But all these studies, they were taking up to 4.5 grams a day, which is a lot. You could add a little bit in your water and your liquids. I mean, it's pretty bitter. Pure MSM from bulk supplements, it's bitter. You know, it's bitter powder, see? I don't mind it so much. It doesn't smell fish foody to me. Some people think it smells like fish food. It almost smells sweet to me. I don't know. It dissolves readily in fluids. Like you could just put a little bit in your fluids throughout the day. Dump a bit. Dissolve. Looks like a little snow globe for a second. And then it's done. Crystal clear. It's not bad. It's not terrible. So I highly recommend trying, you know, putting it in water as like a facial spray, a little refresher. You can put a little, like a drop of essential oil or you could even put it in flower water like my old video. I put it in neroli water and I dumped a bunch in and it actually, it works really well. And I'm impressed with how much you can put in. How it dissolves, shall we? Got our MSM, one level, it makes you funnel. Close the top. See? Quite a lot. <laughs> totally dissolved. Just little bubbles. Let's do another half. Yeah. This is lukewarm water. Cold water might be a little difficult. Let's try it again. Almost totally dissolved. Can you see better? Okay, there we go. It can highly saturate the water. There's bubbles everywhere. You can fit a whole tablespoon, almost completely saturated. Isn't that dope, you guys? How much you could fit into two ounces of water? A whole tablespoon. Dope. It's a refreshing, you know, just skin spritzer. And you kind of, it kind of makes a, when it's that saturated, kind of like a matte finish on your skin. I know my, I'm like wet right now, but. Oh yeah, see, it, it feels very mattifying. It's kind of a nice, you feel, there you go. See, my fit. If you like that video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And you can click the little bell button next to the subscription button to be notified when I put up videos on Thursdays and when I do lives on Tuesdays at 4 p.m. Pacific Standard Time and we discuss supplements, experiences, we have Q&A. I have Q&A about my skincare line as well and which you can click and check out any somewhere around here, guys. Yeah. Thank you very much. Mwah. People use it top, it can really help. There's been studies. So, you know, it's just a flow, a flowing zip. <laughs> it absorb uh, the uh, it permeability of your joints. It's a <laughs> major mineral, methyl sodium, what is it called? <laughs> I'm going to show you how, dang it, this is kind of not the right size. Recutting.